Hello everyone. Today I am going to learn you everything about the second degree equation, which is look like. Uh, just a second. Look like that. A x over by two plus b x plus c equals to zero. We are going to discuss about exceptions. But uh, before that, we are going to uh, solve uh, this equation. And it is, uh, we are dividing every, dividing by a. So it's going to be x2 plus b divided by a x plus c divided by a equals to zero. And we are going to add x2 plus b divided by a x uh, plus b2 divided by 4a2 plus c divided by a equals to b2 divided by 4 multiplied by a power by 2 and this is x plus b divided by 2a power by 2 equals to oh, Is divided by it doesn't doesn't make it okay. and this is uh, x plus b divided by two a over over by by two equals to C divided by A or B power by 2 divided by 4 A power by 2 minus C divided by A. And when we solve, I am going to up here, and it is the x equals to b divided minus minus b divided by 2a plus minus squared b2 divided by 4a2 
minus c divided by a which is x equals to minus b divided by 2a plus minus b power by 2 minus 4ac divided by a divided by 2a. Okay. Uh, I must uh, clean up to save time. Okay. Uh, the solution is so, and uh, this one has uh, missing something here. I must put two. Okay. And uh, we have a few exception or something. If this square is positive, then we have two uh, two uh, solution x one and x two. And if uh, this one is um, is uh, zero then we have only Then the solution is that one, minus b divided by 2a. And if it is negative, then we haven't any real value, real solutions, only two uh, com uh, complex solution. And uh, And the solution and the x one x one plus x two equals to if we uh, if we plus this item is going to be zero, but this one is here, and we have we have. Uh, minus b divided by a and x1 multiplied by x2 equals to c divided by a and the absolute value of x1 minus x2 equals to B2 minus 4AC divided by absolute below, absolute uh, value of A. This is uh, those things you should know. And we are going to now discuss about the exceptions. And I am going to 
Let me clean up here. Now we are going to discuss about exceptions. If if C if C is zero, then A X two plus B X is zero, then X A X plus B is zero, then X is zero or X equals to minus B divided by A. The another exception is the another exception is if b is zero then a x two plus c equals to zero then x one two equals to square minus c divided by a if c a c negative then this one is positive and we have two real solution if uh, if ac is positive then we have two complex uh, solutions The other, the other uh, one is if B equals to C equals to zero, then X one two equals to zero. Because in this, this is zero. This is zero. A X of power by two is zero then both x are zero and then just a second if if a goes to zero then in that part this one goes to zero and the then x1 goes to infinite because this one divided by zero is infinite and the other one the other uh, the other is uh, because this one zero and it is minus b plus b plus minus b it's uh, going to be uh, x2 equals to minus c divided by b and we are going to uh, approve it we are going to put x equals to 1 divided by y and it is going to be c y2 plus 
b y plus a equals to zero and uh, we are going to a goes to zero a a goes to zero and here is going to be c y2 plus b y equals to zero and this is y equals to zero and y equals to uh, minus uh, minus b divided by c but y is 1 divided by x y is 1 divided by x means that x goes to infinite and x goes to minus c minus c divided by b. Okay. Uh, now we are going to uh, solve the uh, problem, and it is uh, m minus one, m two. M two minus one. Multiplied by x2 plus m2 minus 5m plus 4 multiplied by x plus m plus 10 equals to 0. What is m? What is m? So that we have M so that uh, x1 goes to uh, infinite. We saw that uh, if a if a goes to infinite uh, to, to zero, then x goes to infinite. Now, x goes to infinite, we know that m, sorry, we know that m2 minus 1 equals to 0, then m equals to plus minus 1. And uh, if uh, What is M? What is M if both X and uh, X1 and 2 goes to um, infinite? Then we saw before that both A and B are 0. Then B here, it is that one, and it is M2 minus 5M plus 4 is 0, which is M plus 1 multiplied by M plus 4 is 0, which means that M uh, minus 1 and M uh, 
m is minus 4. Now we are going to discuss about few uh, few uh, methods and it is uh, when uh, when uh, a plus b plus c equals to zero then x1 is 1 and uh, and uh, x2 equals to c divided by a if and if and only if Here, we can tell that uh, B equals to minus A minus C and put it in that equation is going to be going to be ax2 minus ax minus cx plus c equals to zero which means that ax multiplied by x minus one plus C minus minus C X minus one equals to zero, which means that X minus one multiplied by AX minus C equals to zero which means that x1 and x equals to c divided by a and in opposite way when we put x equals to one it's going to be a plus b plus c equals to zero and if we put x equals to c divided by a then you are going to get the same We are going through the example and it is uh, 5x2 minus 9x plus 4 equals to 0. And we see that 5 minus 9 plus 4 equals to 0, which means that 0 equals 0. Then x1 is 1 and x2 is c divided by a is um, 4 divided by 5. The other exception is if a plus c equals to b then uh, x1 equals to minus 1 and x2 equals to minus c divided by a and it is if and if and Okay, we are going to put this in this. So it is AX2 plus 
ax plus cx plus c equals to zero, then ax x plus one plus c x plus one is zero, then x plus one multiplied by ax plus c is zero, then x one minus one x two is minus c divided by a which we wanted to show now when we put x1 minus 1 then it is a minus b plus c then it is a plus c equals to b and if you put x equals to minus c divided by a then this one this one up here and put it and also check. We are going to have an example, and the example is uh, example is four uh, x two plus seven x plus three equals to zero then four plus three equals to seven and it is that case then then uh, then x1 is minus one and x2 is minus c divided by a and c is three is minus minus 3 divided by 4. Now we are going to have a very beautiful Okay, we are going to have uh, another example, and it is m minus 1 x2 plus 2m minus 3 x plus m minus 2 equals to 0. And we are seeing that m minus 1 plus m minus 2 equals to 2m minus 3 which is this one plus this one equals to this one then x1 equals to minus 1 and x2 equals to minus m plus 2 divided by m minus 1 Okay, another solution, another exception is if uh, if x1 is k x2 then x1 plus x2 equals to minus b divided by a means that x 1 plus k x 1 equals to minus b divided by a means that k plus 1 x 1 minus b divided by a means that 
x1 equals to minus b divided by a multiplied by j plus 1. And also x1 multiplied by x2 equals to ca means that kx1 power by 2 equals to c divided by a. And when we put this value here, then we get that uh, then we get uh, then we get b power by 2 divided by ac equals to k plus 1 power by 2 divided by k. Now we are going to have an example. We have an example, and it is uh, 5x2 plus m plus 5x plus m equals to 0. Uh, what is m if x1 equals to 5x2? And this means that k equals to 5. And we put it here. b is m plus 5 divided by ac from 5m equals to 5 plus 1. We are going to put here. Power by 2 divided by 5 then m plus 5 equals to thirty six m and uh, m equals to uh, one divided by seven because because it's going m thirty six m minus m equals to thirty five m and m equals to five divided by thirty five it is one divided by k Okay, it was all in this tutorial about the second degrees equation. See you in next tutorial.